Have you ever wondered if there are things you might be unknowingly doing that could be breaking your dog's trust? Trust, the invisible bond between you and your furry friend, is not an entitlement. It is a precious commodity, earned and nurtured over time. It's the foundation of a healthy relationship, bridging the gap between human understanding and canine communication. But just as it's built, it can also be broken. Stay tuned as we dive into common mistakes that can break this trust. Welcome to Dog Love Canine. First on our list is inconsistency in rules. This common error can sometimes be overlooked, but it's a crucial one. Imagine if your boss kept changing the office rules. One day, it's okay to wear casual clothes. The next, it's not. Confusing, isn't it? The same goes for your canine companions. For instance, let's say you allow your dog to snuggle up with you on the couch on Sunday afternoons, but on Monday evening, you scold them for doing the exact same thing. This flip-flopping of rules can lead to confusion and anxiety. Your dog will have a hard time understanding what's allowed and what's not. They may even start to fear trying anything new, worrying it might get them into trouble. Inconsistency in rules doesn't just confuse your dog. It can also break their trust in you. They need to see you as a reliable source of guidance and stability. Remember, consistency is key in building and maintaining trust. Next, we have negative reinforcements. When it comes to training your furry friend, resorting to harsh methods such as shouting or physical punishments can do more harm than good. This approach can lead to a breakdown of trust, making your dog fearful and anxious. Imagine if someone you looked up to suddenly started behaving aggressively towards you. Would you trust them the same way again? Now let's talk about the alternative, positive reinforcements. This could be a simple pat on the head, a treat or verbal praise whenever your dog does something right. By rewarding good behavior, you're teaching your dog what actions are encouraged, creating a positive learning environment. Over time, this approach not only strengthens your bond, but also makes your dog more enthusiastic about learning new things. So when it comes to training your canine companion, remember this golden rule. Positive reinforcement encourages trust and cooperation. So, always opt for positive reinforcements to build a strong bond with your dog. Last but not least, ignoring your dog's emotional needs. Just like you, your canine companion experiences a range of emotions. They can feel joy, fear, loneliness, and even anxiety. Take thunderstorms, for example. The loud noises and bright flashes can be terrifying for dogs. Instead of brushing off their fear, try to provide comfort. Maybe play some calming music or create a safe space for them to retreat to. Companionship is another emotional need. Dogs are pack animals by nature. They crave social interaction and the feeling of belonging. If they're left alone for long periods, it can lead to feelings of isolation and depression. So, make an effort to spend quality time with your dog. Play fetch, go for walks or simply sit with them. Remember, dogs communicate their emotions differently. They won't tell you they're scared or lonely, but their behavior will. Pay attention to these signs. Just like us, our furry friends have emotional needs that we need to respect and cater to. So, those were the three common errors that can break your dog's trust. Let's do a quick recap. Inconsistent rules can confuse your dog, making it harder for them to understand what's expected. Negative reinforcements only encourage fear, not learning. Ignoring your dog's emotional needs can make them feel neglected and anxious. It's vital to remember the importance of consistency, positive reinforcement, and attention to your dog's feelings. Avoid these mistakes and you're on your way to a trust-filled and fulfilling relationship with your dog.